Today we're going to take a look at the SMRT 800. This is the Ultegra level rotors from Shimano. So with these out of the packaging you can really see that these are beautiful rotors. One of the major differences between this and the RT900 Durace version is the aluminum fin to the inside here. Uh, that actually stays silver on these rotors, whereas on the Durace version it's going to be black. Now you can also see as we kind of go into it the three-piece construction. So you can see the steel that's laid on top of the aluminum and then you've got that aluminum fin that goes out towards the center of the rotor and that's what's going to help uh, eliminate some of the extra heat. So that's going to give you a lot better braking performance and that's what they call their Frieza technology with these rotors. Now these of course center lock just as Shimano does and you can take a look at them and just see that the construction of these rotors is really quite nice. Now some people will run the 140s front and rear for really lightweight setups. You'll see a setup like this, 160 up front, 140 rear, which is a nice kind of combination of braking performance. And then on gravel bikes or somebody who just wants all the braking they can have, they might run a 160-160 version on their road bike. Well, let's go ahead and place them on the scale and we'll see exactly what this weighs here. So if we turn our scale on, we'll go ahead and start with our 140 millimeter version and you'll see that that rotor itself weighs in at only 106 grams. Now, if we place our 160 rotor onto the scale, you'll see that it weighs in at 125 grams. So you'll see it's only about 19 grams that you're saving between the rotors. So you can make that decision on whether or not you want to run 160's front and rear or 160-140 combo like this or the weight weenie version at 140-140. Thanks for watching this James the Bike Guy. Go ahead click that subscribe button so you can see more videos like this into the future and check out all of the new bicycle technology.